Begin up front. Bergenheim and Fleischman work the boards. Bergenheim knocked away by O'Reilly. Fleischman on the back check. Bolin. It goes off the outside of the net. Fleischman hits solidly by Eric Johnson. Good opening shift for the Panthers. The veteran Alex Tangay on the four check. Kulikov got it out ahead for Hayes. Bangs it to the line. Bukestad has a step. Jokin it in front. Shoot. Save Arlamov. Oh, what a chance. Avalanche break in the other way. John Mitchell takes a look. Holds. Finds Barry. Good offensive defenseman. Has room. He walks in and shoots and he scores. And Colorado takes the lead. It appeared as though the Florida Panthers got lost in their own zone. So much hard work in the offensive zone. The first time there's any puck possession in the offensive zone and everybody gets caught down too low. This is where everybody wants to do too much. Everybody gets caught here, look. And two of the Colorado Avalanche basically handle four of the Florida Panthers. Colorado, one of the best penalty kills in the NHL this year. Bukestad is in. He shoots Varlamov. Stopped him. Jokinen works it to the point. Ekblad walks the line and gives to Campbell. Slap shot, glove saved by Varlamov, who has come up big here early on. You're stopping the play because of one of your own actions. Not good. Five on three continues. Yoken in at the blue line. Throws it cross ice. Campbell moving, waiting, putting it in front, deflected it, just skipped wide. Varlamov got a piece of the Hayes redirection. Bukestad won the draw, final seconds, the two-man advantage. Campbell. Looking, gives to Ekblad, lets one go, score! Ekblad! The teenager remains red hot. Not Ekblad again. This time, he doesn't bury his head. You may remember the shot right in the stomach of Varlamov. Ekblad had buried his head, took a slap shot. This time, the head is up the whole way, and he's turning this into a hard pass. The head is up. That's the big difference. Olsen spun around, played it up the boards. Huberdeau again. This time gets it out. Here comes Boys down the wing. Boys cuts to the middle. Boys stays with it. Then sticked away by Varlamov. Out in front of Chance, and Varlamov a save on Barkov. Set up by Huberdeau. Panthers have the last five shots on goal since the Avalanche goal on their only shot. You know, 95 attempts on goal. Oh, a turnover here. Fleischman sets up good Branson. Save Varlamov up high. Another great chance. Bergenheim after the loose puck. Dylan Olsen there as well, but it's scooped up by the Avalanche, and they break the other way. Olsen trying to get back to the gate to three on two. Luongo the save. The rebound's in front. And taken away by Fleischman, who clears. Here comes Bukestad over the line. Jokinen on the wing, had a little trouble with it, but plays it back for Ekblad. Jokinen again behind the net. Campbell, Bukestad, shakes off the check. Bukestad puts it in front, the shot deflected to the Hayes shot, stopped by Varlamov. Taken right back again by the Panthers. They're just rolling lines and putting the heat on the abs. Barkov knocked it away for Huberto, in front for Boys. Spinning, looking for it. But now McKinnon check, Panthers hold it in, the Huberto shot is denied. Barlamov with the glove. Longo paddled it to the end boards for Campbell. He gets hit, put out in front for Duchesne. Ekblad just tipped it away. The lead pass too far though for Hayes. And again, Lesens Duchesne to the Panther line. Position well was Campbell. Those two bangs, Campbell back up. Hayes is still out in front of the net, trying to bother Varlamov. That flat carries. Knocked away by Kennan. It's Hayes again for Jokinen. Under pressure, feeds Bukestad. And now Campbell, good puck movement. It's Jokinen shooting Varlamov with a bad save. Duchesne cross ice. Johnson couldn't handle the hard pass. Willie Mitchell over the play. Battle in the corner. Now it goes behind the net. Kulikov played it around. Landeskog finds the open man. And Barry resets his shot, saved by Luongo. You know, you're writing your assessment early in the period. This, this period, much more cautious by both teams. Again, the loose puck fires Luongo way out. Oh, 
two of the old-timers. Luongo and Aginla, not their first rodeo, and Roberto beat him that time. There was a lot of traffic in that pass that Fleischman tried to make, but he saw Bergenheim on that open side. And he got it through on the backhand. Not easy to do. Mitchell sends Huberdeau in. Huberdeau at the angle. Puts it out in front. Save Arlam off the rebound. He stops Boys again. Hayes with Everberg. Everberg controls. Here's Mitchell. Hayda. Slap shot. Save Luongo. Rebound Mitchell. Oh, and it went wide. The Avalanche with a chance. Bowen sticking right with him. And now Landis got with Kulikov down low. Landis got comes out. What you're going to see here is the core of the Colorado Avalanche. They're very best players. Watch how they protect the puck. First of all, it's O'Reilly. Then he gets it. Look at Landeskog protecting the puck. And again, avoiding the check. But you keep control of the puck. That is masterfully done. There you see Landeskog, the captain. He protected the puck. He had Kulikov all over him. But because he is big and strong, just like O'Reilly was... And on that goal, it's just about individual battles. They outwork the Panthers on that goal. Panthers have to be more diligent. Boys puts it in for a score! Barkov! They answer back again! Don't talk minutes. Talk seconds. 23 seconds that time, Denny. And right to our goalie. 23 seconds later. They wipe out the lead that the, that the Colorado Avalanche had. And I'll tell you what, that is as cool as you get. Brad Boys, a perfect strike to Barkov. Yeah, a lot of high picks on the last few years out there. Of course, Eric Johnson with the puck was number one back in 06. Look at him turn and shoot. He hit the post. It's loose in the blue paint. And Roberto's finally got it. Western coaches will be coaching the All-Star game. Ooh. <laughs> Here's a shot right on St. Luongo, the rebound, Luongo, on the cloud, he doesn't know where he is. It comes back to the point, another shot, Luongo's down, is it under him? It is, we get the whistle. Two straight icings by the Avalanche. Straight for the whistle. Kicks in behind the net, Bukestad's on it. That flat up at the point. Rister right on, save, rebound in front, Jokin in backhander, couldn't get it to the net. The air puts it out in front. It came all the way through again and pops it over to the corner. Good Branson. Hit by McLeod. Good Branson cleared it up the wall. Knocked down by Talbot. Shot on goal. Luongo the save. Where is it? They jam at it. And then the whistle. But boy, longevity is important. Here comes Bergenheim. He's got a step. He shoots. Save Arlama. Oh, Bergenheim went end to end and nearly gave the Panthers the lead. Ekblad takes a shot. Blocked out in front. Bolin. Can Barlamov stops him. Landis Gog, Duchesne looking, puts it out in front, deflected just wide by McKinnon. Luongo back up. Here's again, and Johnson with a wrister blocked away in front of the net, and Jokinen able to gather it in. Holding up the middle. Going over the line, O'Reilly catches up to it. Holding cross ice, the shot, Luongo with a save there. On the Barry Blast. O'Reilly again. Good Branson hustling after it, pokes it up the wall. Barry though got a piece of it. It comes to Holden again, the shot, they score! Deflected in front. And the Avalanche have the lead again. You know, it's offensive zone possession time on the power play. The shot by Olden, I believe, hit McLeod, number 55, in front of the net. It took a weird bounce. No chance for Roberto Luongo. What happens here is just the amount of offensive zone time that these Colorado Avalanche are able to create. They never gave up the puck, and again, very impressed at how they protect the puck in the offensive zone. They were 0 for 4 before that one. Campbell on the loose puck. Barkov for Huberto. Turning. Back up high for Ekblad. He'll take a wrister. Knocked down in front. Barkov got a piece of it. Huberto turns and shoots wide. Hayes on the wing. Let's one go. Save Arlamov. 
Again, look. Hands to Landis Cog, the return pass. Campbell back on D, and Luongo makes the save on Jerome Aginla with a good shot. Good Branson. Able to squeak it out to center. Fleischman for Boland. Bergenheim moving on the wing. He's got it. Bergenheim checked as he got to the goal line. Bergenheim again in front. Fleischman stopped by Barlama. Puck still loose, and Barlama will cover. Now 30 seconds now in the Panthers' zone. They need to get it out. Avalanche are working. Again, behind the net. Waits, comes out in front, puts it in the blue paint. Luongo sticks it to the boards. It's on five advantage for Florida, trying to get a tie. Bukestad pulls it back. Here's Ekblad, one-timer, save. It's loose in front. They're trying to find it, save Barlama, and then they shoot it high. Hayes down low. Here's Ekblad taking a shot, it's blocked away. Huberdo along the wall, Ekblad's got a look. Deflected away, Barkov shoots, that's blocked as well. Barkov again, pinballs in front off skates. One more time for Jimmy Hayes. Sets up Barkov, couldn't get a shot off. And here comes again one with the empty net and he scores. Well, again, we'll get that 573 to tie Mike Bossy. I believe that's 20th all time in terms of goals scored in the NHL. Again, 573. And the Florida Panthers did what they needed to do in the desperate situation. They won the faceoff in the offensive zone twice. They had the puck all around the net.